All right, today in this video, we're doing a little shoe battle just for you. Let's go. All right, thanks for tuning in. Glad you are stopping by this video. If you are, you probably want some info on some new golf shoes. I've got uh, some pretty sweet ones here. Full disclosure, both companies have given me these shoes. With the Athlons, I do get a little commission when you use the promo code Mr. Short Game at checkout. Uh, Jack Irwin, I don't get anything. Just uh, doing a, a nice review. And with reviews, I always like to have something to compare it to. So that's why we're doing uh, both of these at the same time. So you can see and get my opinion on uh, one versus the other, how they perform on the golf course. Hope you like the video. If you do, kill that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already and hit the bell notification so you don't miss anything. As always, all the links will be in the description below and uh, links for these, both of these will be down there as well. So be sure to check that out. First, let's get the lowdown on the Jack Irwin shoes. The Jack Irwin golf shoe comes in this white pebble grain leather. Also a black version is available. The shoe is built to achieve on the golf course and designed to look good off of it. It features a Vibram golf outsole, which is specifically designed for comfort, durability, and traction. Mesh lining for enhanced breathability and scotch guarded leather to protect against the elements. Truly a beautiful looking golf shoe. All right, now that you have that, here's the skinny on the Athlons. The Athlons golf shoe currently only comes in this color pattern. However, keep checking their website as new colors are soon to be announced. The golf shoe has a patented technology that shifts the way your body interacts with the ground to give you more power so you can hit the ball farther and more stability so you can hit more fairways. The technology is a force transfer system. Via physics principles, the forces can be manipulated to improve power. Athlon's golf shoes are uniquely designed to include the right angles in the right places to shift forces towards your body to increase your power by at least 9%. The shoe is packed with features such as a comfortable support booty, a roomier toe box, and so much more. Truly a sports performance golf shoe. All right, enough goofing around. Let's hit some shots. So now I just want to hit a bunch of shots comparing uh, one shoe to the other. So I'll hit some with the Athlons, I'll hit some with the Jack Irwins, and we'll just go back and forth. We'll go from tee box, driver, iron, sand shots on the green, do some walking around, do a few other things to really get a good idea of the construction of the shoe, the stability of the shoe, the connection it has with the ground. So sole versus sole, which one, um, you know, how the shoes feel, all that kind of stuff. And then I'll just report back to you kind of my thoughts so you can maybe, you know, take that into account when you're looking for a new shoe and what specific needs you're, you're after in a, in a golf shoe. So let's do it.
Okay, I know what you're thinking. I'm crazy. It's true. Uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna put the shoes to a speed test. See which one is faster. It's 40 yards from the cart or where, just where I set those shoes to here. I'm gonna time it. Full disclosure, I did run track in high school. So I might blow you away with my Usain Bolt uh, speed. I was a pole vaulter though, so I don't know if that helps. Anyways, uh, here we go. Uh, I'm gonna time us with the timer, self-timed, stopwatch, iPhone style. Uh, as soon as I hit the uh, hit this spot, I'll stop it best I can, and then we'll uh, we'll see which shoes I run faster in. I will go first in the Jack Irwins while I'm fresh. Give them a little uh, I don't know, little bone uh, advantage, right? Because the the Athlons are more of an athletic shoe. So we'll run fresh in the Jack Irwins. Okay, here we go. Give you the results as soon as I'm done. Two 40 yard sprints. If I drop dead, just for you guys. Rock and roll. I am so slow. 628. All right. Take about an hour break. I'll come back. <laughs> uh, no, we're going right away. Here we go. Athlon's up next. I'm still slow. 543. Much faster in these. Ah, good stuff. Good stuff. I don't think I've ever changed shoes so many times in my life. Can't tell you how many times I forgot to hit record. Didn't have it. I had to go do the whole thing over again. Whew. <laughs> well, crazy. Hope, hope you had as much fun as uh, I did uh, making this as you did watching it. I don't know. So we had the uh, Athlons, these bad boys, versus Jack Irwin. Bam. Beautiful shoes, by the way. Love them both. Okay. Here is the break. There's no way I run a six and a half 40. That's slow. No hate, okay? No hate. I, you know, I'm recording it, I'm stop watching myself. I gotta hit the button as I run the, there's at least a second delay. I don't run a four something, but five, five something might be more accurate. I don't know. Anyways, had a good time. Here is the lowdown of these shoes, okay? Um, if, if, if you're going for sports performance, okay? Sports performance, uh, using the ground forces, maximum stability, maximum uh, shoe support, that thing's wrapping around your foot and you like that and you like that, um, that athletic style of shoe, like a football shoe, a cleat, a softball, something like that, then for sure I would go with the Athlons. They hug your foot, I mean, it's amazing. Uh, they have a much higher, uh, top here, it's not a high top, but it, this wraps around uh, the top or part of your ankle so much better. So you have maximum stability here, amazing ground traction, and just what you feel in this is better than any other shoe I've ever used on the golf course in terms of athletic performance. These are the top of the line, in my opinion, okay? If you're more of a stylish type of person and or you're gonna go out later and you, and, you, and you want something that you can wear with more of a, a dress up style of look, let's say you're going out after the round or something like that, the Athlons isn't gonna look good in slacks and a nice shirt, okay? Uh, but the Jack Irwins, bam, you can wear these on the golf course, throw a change of shirt on or whatever where you pull, go out for a dinner, whatever you want, and you're gonna feel fine and comfortable. You can even wear these, even if you didn't play golf, they're that nice of a shoe. So, if you're looking for, you know, more of a, a Freddy Couples style of a, of a golf experience, then I would go with the Jack Irwins. These are fantastic shoes. Waterproof, nice leather, Vibram sole. I love those, uh, the sole. One thing I was worried about, I was worried about uh, 
whether or not these would squeak. I hate squeaky golf shoes. It's so annoying. When you're squeak, squeak, you're walking around the greens and you hear this squeaker. Nobody likes that. So I was worried about that with these because I've had similar shoes before like this that have squeaked. I put these to the test. No squeak with these. So no squeak. I, I don't, don't get squeaky shoes, okay? So uh, if you're looking for something elegant, there you go. The support, yeah, the support is nowhere near the Athlons, but the comfort is nice. And I made more putts with these and I chipped one in with this. So they have good traction. I did feel like it could slip, okay? I, I didn't slip, but I felt like uh, it's gonna slip more than the Athlons or even a spike shoe. This has the, the tread, it keeps you from slipping. And uh, these are just the nubs. So these could slip, but we are on wet conditions today, early morning, the dew, they just sprinklered. So it was wet and I did not slip. So I won't say you will slip. I'm just saying I felt like I could slip in these, but I did, they were incredibly comfortable, much lower to the ground and more flexible than the Athlons. So it really depends on what you're looking for. Uh, I'll wear these when I'm, you know, just cruising around. Maybe you you're, have some meetings or something like that and you're gonna go hit some balls and you don't wanna change shoes all the time. Then I'm gonna wear these all day long and just look cool, look nice. And uh, I'm not gonna wear these to the office or anything like that, but, uh, or out to dinner. But if I want maximum stability, like I said, Athlons is the way to go. So I hope you like this little shoe review. Had a good time doing it. Hit that like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Till next time, love you guys. Best of luck with your footwear out there. See you in the next video.